Oh, that dribbling. Oh. Yo, guys, what is going on? Welcome back to another video on the channel. And today we're going to be checking out Gio Reyna's card, guys. Yes. Gio Reyna's card, Giovanni Reyna. And he is very expensive on this game. Right now, he's like 1.7 mil. So he's not a cheap card. He's not too affordable. But he's arguably one of the better Bundesliga strikers slash cam. Timothy Lewandowski is only like six to seven hundred K more than this card. So that is also something to consider, guys. That a card like that is not actually that much more than this card. Um, 90 pace, 91 dribbling, 89 shooting, 92 passing, and 81 physical. Uh, he doesn't have any crazy traits. He just had technical dribbler trait. He's got 91 acceleration, 89 sprint speed, 90 finishing, 84 attack positioning, 94 shot power. Some crazy stats there. 99 agility, which is really the stat that I'm curious to see how that plays. Um, 85 stamina, 85 strength, which is good. But yeah, the dribbling is super, super good. I mean... I think the one thing you got to consider is that he is six foot one. Uh, so no matter how good the dribbling is, six foot one may limit how he feels. Uh, but he's got incredible short passing. He's got just really good stats overall. We're going to give him a hunter uh, to boost the acceleration, the sprint speed, and the attack positioning and the finishing. But um, I think we can play him in a couple positions. I think we can play him as a cam. I think we can play him as a striker. So I think there's a lot of variety with where we can play him, which is cool. So we're going to test him out in a bunch of positions. Guys, if you enjoy the Future Stars reviews, drop a thumbs up. We also have... All of these reviews going up on the channel in a playlist. So you guys will be able to see if any of these guys you're curious about. You guys can check them out on the channel. And we have tons of reviews for them. So thanks for watching, guys. And let's get into it. Arena. Going well. Sound Pretty big. It's a great run. I'll take it away. Got the physical oh, to fill off here. Ron. Can he finish? Well, last and Veron defending. comes out of nowhere. But Brilliant you know what? Defending. We have for a nice little goal. Play, but advantage it is, and they continue to advance, and a lot of options here. Well, spot on with that challenge. Is it going to be nice pass? Another one for him. Can they hit on the break? Nice pass. Oh, he's really opened them up here. So, Boss Loy. Oh, good skill, and he's managed to beat his man. Keeping the ball moving. Long way out, this. Goalkeeper to... A real opening Nice. Now. And there it is. The well, I think both these guys, though, man, they, they just feel like they're too big, man. I don't know. Absolutely fantastic. An nice finish. Nice play. I love your stream. It's been a great year subbing. Yo, thanks, man. Oh, that was nice, man. But I think that was on his weak foot. That was nice, though. This is looking threatening. And he's broken free. No, I should have just shot it. I don't know why I go for the chips there, bro. I should have just shot it. Would have gone in. Can he do from here? A glorious chance. Oh, that was a nice play. Gnabry. Cole. Teammate available. Oh, shit. Nice goal. The shooting, like, every time we've shot with him, I felt like it was going to go in. So, I noticed the shooting for sure. Nice ball. I like that attack positioning. He made a good run there. Right there, he doesn't feel too clunky too, which is a good sign. So the finesse shot with Reyna, I actually thought that was not going in. But the keeper made a little bit of a mistake. Well, the whip game, isn't uh, goal, truly insane. I mean, that was a little bit... You see that shot sometimes going in that top corner. But again, we get the finish and it's on target. That's important, right? That when you're getting these good angles that he's going to put the goals on target. That's very important. So neither uh, neither Sabusai or uh, Reyna really feel like they have an incredible finesse shot. But we're going to keep testing all types of finishing with these guys. Because it's very important to know what they can and can't do on both feet. 
And Reyna has this ability where if you do the directional nutmeg or any type of acceleration that he really accelerates, which I think is something definitely unique to the card. Great run. Can we get that pass through? Marcel Zabitza. Another eyeing that final pass you just feel. Man, Kleber is so hard to pass. But we almost get the finish there, guys. Gio Reyna? Wow, what a finesse shot, man. Okay, so outside the box. And a really nice finesse shot from Gio Reyna. I really liked that angle. I thought that was good. And that's a good sign for his finesse shot, right? You're getting the looks outside the box and they're going in. Good tackle. Good run, though. Nice pass. I think he'll carry on. Cheers, Jeff. Good strength. Wow. That's crazy strength there, man. Nice finish on the weak foot. We'll take it. A little bit of a scrappy goal there, but we'll take it. Well, you don't want to concede early in the game, and the goalkeeper is the hero there. He's in behind. Reyna on the right. Wow. This guy has a crazy, crazy power shot. I'm, I'm really impressed with the power on his shooting. I mean, I, this might be one of the most powerful shots I've used yet in, uh, in this game. Jeez. Oh, that dribbling. Oh. That dribbling. Oh, we couldn't finish it at the end, man. Oh, what dribbling that was. Wow. It's a really, really good save in the end. Fruitful looking attack. Marcel Zabitza. Great opportunity. That that power shot is crazy. And Oblak is one of the best keepers at saving these shots with a lot of power. And you can see that Oblak even got a hand on it, but Reyna was able to put it past him no matter what. I love that dribbling right there. And we draw a penalty, man. We draw a penalty. So he was able to dribble past the center back and get on a break. And now we're going to give him the chance to make a penalty here, guys, for his hat trick. And he does, man. We get a hat trick with the third goal in the 22nd minute, man. So Gio Reyna is giving us a great display of scoring this game. I'm very impressed so far. His dribbling feels very, very solid in this one. Let's freaking go. Great touch there from Sabaslai. Can we play it wide here with Reyna? Yes, we can. Nice ball. That ball is insane. Oh, good read from Davies there. Ooh, on the weak foot. It didn't go in, but the power was definitely past the keeper. So the power shot on this card is just crazy. Wow, the dribbling with the strength here is pretty impressive. His strength is really nice on the ball when you can get moving with him. The power shot, and you already know, guys, the Gio Reyna power shot is going in. There's no way it's going to miss. It's just too good with him. The commentary box by Lee Dixon, and we have a foot rivals match coming up for you. It's the Invincibles up against the Dons. Well, I'm excited about this one. Oh, what a save, man. Crazy save from Venersar there. We almost got a crazy goal. Get it going. Reyna, let's go. The rainbow and the angled finish, man. Reyna is doing it all for us guys up top. What a goal, man. What a goal. So he's able to do well with even with his body type to get into the right places. And players waiting in the center. Can he open them up here? Oh, unlucky to not get the finish there. It was a good angle across net. And Venersar is very impressive this game. Wow. Okay, guys. So, Gio Reyna, guys, gave us 11 goals, 4 assists, and 5 games. And that was pretty nice. I can't lie, right? The goals were coming. And I think when we take a look at the positives with this card, his shooting is incredible. His power shot is next to none. I've never really had a card that can break the net like this guy. Pretty much Eusebio and maybe Lewandowski's team of the year this year had this level of power to their cards. Messi's team of the year has a lot of power too. So that was a positive. Now for the price, I do think this price is a little overvalued. In game, he feels very generic and average. Uh, there's nothing really too special about his card besides the shooting. Now he did have some moments of really nice dribbling and you can see the 99 agility with the response in this, but there are times, again, where he does feel a little bit stiff, and that's due to the height, the body type, and probably the lack of traits, to be honest. It's probably the lack of traits is the big deal, but 
Finishing was really good. I thought if I'm going to compare this guy to a card, it was very similar to Havertz's team of the season in FIFA 19, uh, except he doesn't have a five-star weak foot. It feels kind of like that card um, if you guys wanted a comparison. Now, obviously, without heading and first-time shots being not really a meta this year, it's not a crazy card. But overall, I thought he was a solid card. I think he's one of the better Bundesliga attackers. I still think Lewandowski's team of the year was a lot better than this card. Um, but again, I think this card has a unique aspect to it that he really can shoot the ball um, and that's really nice to see I think if I were to give him a rating for coins uh, on the market you know and what I would what you value you're getting for this type of card uh, considering all things I would probably give him a 7.8 7.9 8.0 nothing too impressive but again a pretty incredible f uh, power shot and probably one of the best American cards we've ever had in FIFA definitely a card that you can use in foot champions in high division rivals ranks definitely a decent card